Everywhere you spit, there are only queens now. They are sincerely convinced that they owe no one anything, and were born to be happy and wear beautiful dresses. They are convinced that they are not cooks, or housekeepers, or any kind of peasant women or commoners. Let us examine the true meaning of the words, queens and peasant women. So, queen is the title of the consort of the reigning king, or the reigning monarch of a kingdom, if that title is given to a woman. At the same time, we look into the word princess, which the same women like to call themselves. A princess is a direct descendant of monarchs, that is, the daughter of a king. And queen, a person from a royal family, and the heir to the future throne, or a potential bride of a prince, heir to some other throne, who is given in marriage to him, for some political purposes. Between states, it follows that any woman, except the daughters of politicians or big businessmen, are neither queens nor princesses. But then who are they? Could they be the same peasant women? Let's look into who a peasant woman is. A peasant woman is a woman engaged in agriculture, who attends church regularly, has no bad habits, and keeps her virginity until marriage. Does the modern woman have all these qualities? No bad habits, going to church regularly, working in agriculture, keeping her virginity until marriage? Well, of course not. At least the vast majority don't. I'm sorry, I don't want to offend normal women, who may be out there somewhere. There are always exceptions to every rule. So, a modern woman has no royal title and origin, so she is not a queen or a princess, nor does she have her own household and virginity, which means she is not a peasant. No good dowry means she is not a bride. But what do all these self-proclaimed princesses, queens, and not so peasant women have only one thing, and that is price. And what is the name of a woman who knows her price? Such women are called, very simply, prostitutes. But since she sells her body, not for money, but for its equivalent, namely, a man's position, his income level, restaurant paid, dinners, and gifts. That is why the most correct name for such a woman is domestic prostitute. Thank you for watching.